Here we are in South Africa, where 85% of the world's remaining rhinos are. We have the perfect storm of extremely poor people living just across the fence of an extremely profitable item, the wildlife reserve. We find a dead rhino. His face is hacked off. People are making a lot of money. You get angry. Tipping point has already happened where more rhinos have been killed than born. A rhino poaching is organized crime. It's definitely pretty much a war against these rhino poachers. Some of the people, they are poor. Maybe they try to get something. Some of them, they die there in the bush. We only look at protecting it through the barrel of a gun. Our grandchildren aren't going to see rhino or elephant or anything. It's a crime of a very serious nature. More and more people expected us to kill people to protect these animals. I couldn't see the logic in it. But we're not going to win this war by catching all the poachers, and especially killing the poachers. Every death of a poacher, we're making more enemies. We're holding the line here but we're not going to win. We sent man to the moon. Surely we can find another way to protect the rhino. So we're going straight to the heart of, of the rhino poachers. They said, well, we could use some help with the soccer league. It's going to win far more hearts and minds towards wildlife than sending people home in wooden boxes to bury. Uplifting people will actually save the rhino more than arresting those people. Their life is now enhanced because those rhinos are alive, not better because they're dead. Football's called the greatest game. So why can't the greatest game save the greatest animal?